Kathy Whitworth set a benchmark in golf no one has ever touched, whether it was Sam Snead or Tiger Woods, Mickey Wright or Annika Soren Stam. Her 88 victories are the most by any player on a single professional tour. Whitworth, whose LPGA Tour victories span nearly a quarter century and who became the first woman to earn $1 million on the LPGA, died on Christmas Eve, her longtime partner said. She was 83. Betty Odell did not disclose a cause of death, saying only that Whitworth died suddenly Saturday night while celebrating with family and friends. Kathy left this worth the way she lived her life loving, laugh, and creating memories, Odell said in a statement released by the LPGA Tour. Whitworth won the first of her 88 titles in the Kelly Girls Opens in July 1962. She won six majors during her career and broke Mickey Wright's record of 82 career wins when Whitworth captured the Lady Michelode in the summer of 1982. Her final victory came in 1985 at the United Virginia Bank Classic. Winning never got old, Whitworth once said. All that was missing from her career was the U.S. Women's Open, the biggest of the women's majors. Upon being the first woman to surpass $1 million in career earnings in 1981, she said, I would have swapped being the first to make a million for winning the Open, but it was a consolation which took some of the sting out of not winning. Whitworth was the AP Female Athlete of the Year in 1965 and in 1967, when she easily beat out Wimbledon singles champion Billie Jean King. Whitworth was inducted into the World Golf Hall of Fame in 1982. She was the LPGA Player of the Year seven times in an eight-year span 1966 through 1973. She won the Vare Trophy for the lowest scoring average seven times, and she was the leading money winner in eight seasons.